So guys, um, this is the flower we are going to collect the pollen from. Um, if you watch closely, you will see those itty bitty tiny things. These are the the sperms of the sour shop tree, you can say. And we are going to collect them from this flower. And we will use them on the same flower, but we will use them on other flowers. Um, if you look closely, you will see this flower got a hole in it. If you look closely, um, on the inside of this, um, yes, on the inside of this, wait a minute. So guys, we are back. Um, if you watch closely, you will see there is some. Yes, that this one is the stamper. Um, on this part of the flower, this is the female part of the flower. Um, we will say this is the place where the eggs are supposed to be. <laughs> In human yeah in human terms but this is the female part of the flower and here is where you want to get the sperms of the other flower um, if you touch this you will see it got some sticky so, yeah it's a it's a it's a little bit sticky and that stickiness is just to it's just to help the the sperm um, stick to the flower so that it can melt down into this into this part of the flower and become a fruit. So this flower will also drop these shells. These shells are just to protect this part of the flower, and when it drop these shells, it becomes this. yes when it drop when it drop the shells if you watch closely it becomes this then it got the male part of it and on this yes this this here is the sperm of the source of tree and after dropping after this flower drop the shells it will look just like this one and after Two, three days it will be looking like this and when it looks like this it will take about a month before it becomes a, a source of fruit then you know it worked um, at the moment I don't have any source of fruits to show you guys but in about two three months i think i will have some to show to show you guys because my tree got a lot of flowers and a lot of insects these these insects are unique i only saw them on source of trees but let's get into it i will collect the seed from this flower with a soft brush all you need for this is a soft brush a dry one one that is dry because the seeds are supposed to be kept dry and you will collect them into a plastic bag or a cup or whatever but you should collect them and keep them dry and sealed so i will collect them from this flower i will also use them on this stamper then i will use them on this stamper uh, the reason behind this is to help nature because 
if there are 10 flowers in your tree and you want all 10 of them to become fruits then this is the matter this then this is the thing you should be doing if you wait if you wait on the ends it might have it might happen that the ants and the bee don't do this process for you on every on every single one of the of the 10 flowers in your tree but this is what i am going to do for all the flowers in this tree so let's get into it so guys here you see i am taking the seed from the male part of the flower I am also rubbing it against the female part of the flower um, they are falling into this bag as you can see them on the bottom of the bag so let's keep collecting them um, I am filming this with one hand and I'm using the other hand to collect the seed so excuse my video techniques but this is and as you can see I don't know if my camera will focus on the brush yes but if you if you look closely you will see that the brush got some of that seed the sperm of the flower and this part of the and this this part of the flower um, I don't know if it will focus but the yellow things you see on the brush are the are actually the sperm of the flower and this is what you want to get onto this part of the other flower so you take your brush and you put it in there make sure to rub it gently what you are actually doing is you are getting the flower pregnant <laughs> and you should be gentle uh, watch how the brush comes out you see the brush was dry when I put it in there um, if you watch closely you will see that it is kind of wet at the moment and that wetness helps those seeds to stick onto the stamper yeah so guys that was it for this part of the video now we should wait to about two three months to see if this flower is going to be a fruit there are chances that the flower will not make it to the phase where it becomes a fruit because it, the tree can choose to drop it or insects might have an effect or the weather might have an effect on it so there is not a hundred percent chance that it will survive but this helps you to be one step ahead of nature Thanks for watching and stay tuned for the next video.